Tesla's upcoming mini car will take over all cities in Europe. Do you remember back in 2018 when Elon Musk was joking and tweeted that Tesla was working on a mini car that could squeeze in an adult? Well, we were so excited about that car. But unfortunately, it has been a few years since we have seen a mini Tesla EV coming into production. And we still don't know when it will happen. But what if we tell you that Tesla is making a car that is smaller than the usual car? Or perhaps we should say a mini car? Well, that would be awesome, right? But hey, doesn't it sound really ironic that a company that is the biggest in the EV market is making a small car? Well, actually, it doesn't matter how ironic it is. We still know that it is going to be a great car because the features and technology that Tesla is putting into their vehicle is far from other mini cars. So you want to know more about this car? Then switch this video to full screen and watch this video till the end. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Tech United, a channel where you can find everything about tech. And in today's video, we are going to talk about the first Tesla mini car. But before we head into the video, consider liking and subscribing to the channel and also don't forget to press the bell icon. With that being said, let's begin. According to some experts, this car, which is usually referred to as Model A, may be the first Tesla coupe. Model A is inspired by the tall boy styling of the Model Y, with its pair of scissor doors, four seats and a full glass canopy. Safety is a big factor in the overall design of the Model A, as it is for every Tesla product. Every part of the car is made of aluminium and metal to provide maximum strength. In case of a crash, the rigid body structure, low center of gravity, and generous crumple zones ensure the greatest amount of protection. The Model A is one of the most unique cars in the world. There are sliding doors attached to the ceiling that can be slid out and lifted up for ease of access. With these automatic sliding and semi-folding of the front seats, it is very easy to climb into and out of the rear seats. Its minimalist, guilt-free interiors are comprised of sustainable materials such as hemp fiber, milk cartons, and wine corks, which are all made from recyclable and sustainable sources. As a driver, you are still able to use the smartphone as a key and access all the driver controls through the central 13-inch touchscreen. In the interior of the car, there is a fully glass electrochromic roof that extends from front to back, giving passengers a seamless view of the sky or maximum shade if they so desire. Tesla's Model A has the smallest footprint of any Tesla car, but its interior space is never compromised. The car's stretched wheelbase and virtually non-existent overhangs ensure ample space for four adults, while the forward-designed instrument panel allows for more legroom for passengers standing in the front seat. Its understated interior includes a sliding center console with plenty of coverage, storage, and a wireless charging station for two smartphones. In 2018, Tesla CEO Elon Musk ceremonially tweeted that Tesla is working on a pint-sized EV that can squeeze an adult. That was a year after introducing the Tesla Model 3. Except, if Musk was referring to a three-fourth scale, Tesla by the biggest electric car company, Tesla fans and converts have long clamored for an affordable Tesla EV, specifically the Tesla Model A. Currently, the cheapest new Tesla is the Model 3 Standard Range Plus, which costs $44,990 before federal tax incentives. In reality, though, we'd rather see the mythical $25,000 Super Mini, the Tesla that appeals to the masses. Since we are unable to wait for Musk's decision, we have devised a Tesla mini car with all the unique quirks you would expect from the most disruptive force in the auto industry since Henry Ford invented the assembly line. But apparently this isn't the first time that Musk has tweeted about plans that may seem absurd to outsiders, but that then turn into reality. He posted a tweet in 2018 in which he posted an idea about opening an old school drive-in, roller skates and rock restaurant at one of the new Tesla supercharger locations in Los Angeles. However, it is impossible to take Elon Musk's tweets at face value. Just ask the SEC and JP Morgan Bank. But it got many people wondering whether a tiny Tesla micro EV would actually work. After all, this sort of vehicle is more utilitarian in nature than sleek and luxurious, two properties Musk clearly admires in his cars. However, currently the Model S Radio Flyer is only suitable for children ages 3 to 8 and has a weight capacity of 81 pounds. Initially, the $500 EV comes with a standard 130 watt hour battery. It can easily be swapped out, similar to the battery swap system used on Gogoro scooters. And an optional premium 190 watt hour battery is also available for an additional $60. Well, doesn't this sound like a good way to convert kids to become fans of Tesla and electric vehicles at a young age? 
However, in fact, it charges just like a regular EV, so it's a good learning experience about EV ownership, charging infrastructure, and the experience of owning an EV. But apart from Tesla, Wuling Motors also makes a mini EV. Wuling Hongguang Mini EV is the result of a joint venture between the Chinese state-owned automaker SAIC Motor, Wuling Motors, and General Motors of the United States. A Wuling Hongguang Mini EV is 115 inches long, 59 inches wide, and has a height of approximately 64 inches, which is a very compact vehicle in every sense of the word. Despite its small size, the car weighs just 665 kilograms and has a short wheelbase of 76.4 inches. According to the manufacturer, the electric car is said to have a range of 170 kilometers per charge. The car is able to reach a top speed of 100 kilometers per hour. It is estimated that Wuling Hongguang Mini EV sold more than 36,000 units in January 2021, compared to the Tesla Model 3, which sold around 21,500 units in the same month. Additionally, Wuling Hongguang Mini EV sold over 20,000 units in February 2021, while Tesla Model 3 sold just 13,700 units. As a result of its performance, Tesla Model 3 was able to break into the top 20 best-selling cars in Europe, 28 European countries, monitored by JATO Dynamics, where plug-in electric cars expanded their market share to 19%. And as data indicates that over 141,429 Tesla Model 3 vehicles have been registered worldwide, up 64% year-over-year, including a record 27,358 in December, the top result of the month, compared to a year ago, it was down 9% to 85,213%. And it is enough for the car to rank 17th among the best-selling vehicles in Europe. In fact, Tesla has been the number one monthly seller twice, September and December. The EV volumes data indicate that Tesla sold 95,247 units in 2019, number one BEV, and about 87,642 units in 2020, behind the Renault Zoe with 99,613. There was no other electric car to even make it into the top 50, which would require more than 72,234 units. However, the most recent Tesla nameplate in Europe, the Model Y, Tesla's last nameplate here had a total of 8,085 deliveries, which in normal times would make it a podium contender. However, it only managed to secure a fourth place finish in the near record month of January, losing to the number three, Dacia Spring, by fewer than 100 units. And it is expected that Y will behave much better during 2022 especially after the first week of summer, as the MIG, made in Germany, production ramps up to decent levels. In contrast to the Model 3's focus on the largest European cities, the crossover's main markets have a decidedly Scandinavian flavor. Norway, 2,379 units, Sweden, 1,532 units, and Denmark, 772 units are among the top markets, along with the Netherlands, 908 units. It is interesting to note that the Model Y's sales in Europe's biggest market, Germany, amounted to just 566 units. Aside from that, with the Cybertruck and Roadster still awaiting to be delivered to consumers, it is definitely clear that Tesla has its hands full at the moment. But that doesn't stop people from dreaming of what's going inside Tesla's headquarters. Well, we are guessing that there's some wild stuff happening behind those doors. Anyways, what do you guys think about this? Do you think this mini car is going to take over all other mini EVs? Tell us in the comments. And that's all for today. We'll see you in the next one. Until then, stay safe. Peace.